Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing, Gemini? This is Positive Thoughts and Energy. Welcome to my channel. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, whenever you come across my channel. Hope everyone is staying safe. My returning subscribers, thank y'all so much for your warm, your warm comments, your likes, and your shares. It just really, really warms my heart. Thank you so, so kindly. My new viewers, cross watchers, you are welcome as well. Please take what resonates and leave the rest. Only take what resonates and leave the rest for someone else. Okay? This may not resonate with everyone. It may not resonate for everyone. Thank you so much. Let's get started doing something different. See what your energy is with the energy oracle card deck, okay? I'm going to pull two cards to see the energy you're in right now. Thank you, Spirit. Holy Spirit. This is for Gemini Spirit. This is for Gemini. What is two cards for Gemini Spirit? This is for Gemini. This is for Gemini. One more card for Gemini Spirit. Thank you. All right, let's read this first one. The Temple Path. There's spirits all around here. The Temple Path. Yeah. The temple path. Sacred. Do some of you have a sacred place? A very sacred temple place in your home? Around you? I see spirit is all around. All around you. Tell me more. Okay. Yeah. A thinking woman. This can also represent a thinking man as well. Yeah, I feel as though I see a lot of what stands out in both of these cards is a lot of green, wealth. I see butterflies. I see transformation for a lot of you, Gemini. I see transformation. I see thinking differently. Let's just say the temple path. Do some of you have a secret, a, a secret temple somewhere that you manifest? Spirit is saying, go to that temple place. And you can get clarity because a lot of you are thinking a lot. Some of you can be thinking too much. And Spirit wants you to go to that sacred place that you have. Excuse me. Yeah, I've already pre-shuffled these cards. Let's see what spirit is for Gemini. Yeah, the Empress. Like I said, a lot of you are very beautiful, have really been through a lot. You can manifest anything you have. You have, um, you're very beautiful. You have that crown, you have that intuition, you have that magic. You know, you're very beautiful, very handsome, and you're doing a lot of thinking. Let's find out what's going on. Okay. 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 So, what I'm getting here, Gemini. It's that a lot of you are really beginning to start a new journey. I feel as though that a lot of you in your recent past, even though the Six of Cups card is not out here, but I feel in this energy here that a lot of you in your recent past went through a, a lot of deceitfulness, a lot of cheating, lies, and uh, third parties. Uh, it, it really hurt your heart. Okay. I really feel like, you know, you know your worth, you know who you are. And I, I really feel like 
that hurt and pain and deceitfulness, it is over. You're ready to start a new journey. You've had an enlightenment. You've had an epiphany. Hey, this is, you know, you're saying this like, hey, you know what? You've been thinking, yes, I've been through all of that. I've been hurt, but I'm ready to start my new journey. A lot of you have transformed. A lot of you really take your spirituality very serious. A lot of praying and meditating. I see a lot of praying and meditating in this reading. Good, oh, yeah, here we are. Good luck, good fortune is bringing something back around to you. There's abundance. There's a commitment, long duration commitment, or a or, or windfall, a heritage of money coming towards you. Spirit, this is for Gemini. What message you have for Gemini? Okay. Gemini. Like I said before, a lot of you are meditating. You may have Virgo in your chart. A lot of you have been meditating, praying. Like I say, I see I seen green. That's why I was saying I see green. That must be a sign of money's coming your way. But not only that, I see that it, like I said before, a lot of you are doing some meditating, going within yourself. See that light right here where I was telling you, right there? A lot of you, wherever your temple at. In your home, your heart, your mind, a lot of you are in your sacred place. And you're really thinking about your next journey. Yeah. You're definitely curious about your next journey. Because you are the empress or the emperor. Yeah, I see nothing but happiness and abundance and, and success for you, Gemini. Good luck, good fortune is bringing something back around to you. Good luck. Yeah, I feel as though, yeah. Whatever you was going through, this heart pain, this, this, um, Deceitfulness, this heart, deceit. I feel as though that you moved out of that, or some of you are moving out of it as we speak, or some of you have already moved out of it. There's a message coming in for you, Gemini. Yeah, there's a message coming in for you, something you've been waiting on. You've been waiting on your ships. You've been waiting on this message. Tell me more about Gemini spirit. Tell me more about Gemini. Thank you. Yeah. Because you don't have time for BS anymore. That's why a lot of you moved away from that. Anything else for Gemini? Anything else for Gemini spirit? Anything else for Gemini? Yeah. You lay, you think about it. A lot of your, in your thought, thought process, your thinking. Anything else for Gemini spirit? Yeah, you're thinking. You're trying to decide. You're at a crossroad. You're at a crossroad as far as At a crossroad and thinking how you want your next journey to be. Well, it's going to be successful. It's going to be whatever happens in your next journey. It's going to be very successful. It's going to be very successful. Because you're really thinking all of this through. You're thinking your next journey through. You're thinking your next journey on what you want to do. And a lot of you have went to your secret place, your sacred place, and you've done a lot of praying, a lot of meditating. And now you're just curious to know what is out there. What is out there? Yeah, you have had an enlightenment. What is out there for me? 
once you moved out of this deceiving energy and lies and you say I don't have time for the BS anymore now you you, you want something whatever's coming to you is going to be very successful and it's going to be long term longevity yeah Gemini that's what it's going to be any other message for Gemini spirit any other message for Gemini Yeah, I feel like at one point in time you were holding yourself back. At one point in time you was nostalgia, kept looking back on the hurt and the pain and the lies and the cheating. Yeah, at one point in time you were doing that. But you ended that. You ended that and you got back focused on what it is that you want for your life. I really feel like a lot of you really put a lot of thought into this decision. Yeah. A lot of thought in this decision of moving away, you know. Because it definitely worried you. I really feel as though a lot of you took your, you did a lot of thinking and reflecting on this relationship that you were in. Relationship, job, whatever that was causing a great deal of pain. You said, you know what, I got to end that. And you got some exciting changes coming your way, some success. But you had to really, you had to really take your time and go within your sacred place, your, your, your peace, your peace. And really say, you know what, I'm ready for a change. When you made that decision, look what you look what you look what you manifested, because you said, "I'm ready for this change. I'm ready to end this, and I'm ready for a new beginning. I'm ready for this change." That's what a lot of y'all said, Gemini. This is positive thoughts and energy. Until next time.